Hello, friends. I'm Pastor Sai. Praise me. And this is the church of you. Praise us. Oh, yes. Folks, God is pissed off that a lot of you claim to serve him, claim to be pro-life, but in fact are giant hypocrites. Oh, how could you? Some of you who claim to be pro-life couldn't give less of a crap about the actual life of a woman who is pregnant. Oh, how could you? Let's watch a video that spurred God to talk to us about this today. probably delete this later, but I've been actively miscarrying since the 8th. I have gone to a doctor. This is my second visit to the ER. If you're wondering why women's rights matter, I'm just gonna fucking bleed out on this table before somebody comes and actually helps me. This is my life. Nobody actually is coming to help. They're always gonna send me home. Jesus Christ, folks. This is absolutely repulsive. Oh, yeah, so saith the Lord. And why would you call yourself pro-life if you couldn't care less about the life of the woman? <laughs> if you are pro-life and don't consider all the life that is, what does that make you? What does that make you, huh? <laughs> that makes you garbage. Yes, praise the Lord. God is sick of people who try to make things black and white in a heavily gray world. Hello? Come on now. There are so many things that can make a situation what it is. Life is complicated. Anything that makes you think 100% in black and white makes you ignorant. So say it, the Lord. He's so true, so right, so wise. Oh, yes. So, God wonders, if you are the ignorant scumbag who thinks abortion should be illegal in all cases, including a miscarriage that endangers the life of a woman, what's your motivation, huh? God wonders, what's your motivation? Is your motivation actually pro-life? Is it? Is it? Oh, I don't think so. No. You Christian nationalists are absolutely scum. Your goal is to make us all live like you want us to. What kind of freedom is that? That's trash. Well, guess what God says? This is America. Screw off. I do not care about how you want me to live. Get lost. We have freedom of religion, freedom of speech, and lots more. Oh, yes. It's so beautiful. Oh, yes. That will never change in America. And God thinks that is delicious. Oh, so do I. Oh, yes. God loves and accepts us all. No matter our beliefs. Once again, God loves and accepts us all. No matter our beliefs. Oh, yes. That's so glorious. Who does God not accept? Awful people. And if you are a person who is pro-life but don't actually care about the mother as well, God loathes you. Loathes you. Sounds like you're going to be burning for a little crispy thing in the afterlife. <laughs> yes. Thanks for stopping by. Praise me. Praise us all. And subscribe for more wisdom.